In health news now, the CDC says that at least 11 people have confirmed cases of the coronavirus right here in the U.S. But in China, the virus has infected more than 17,000 people so far and also killed at least 360 other people. And take a look at this hospital in China. It was actually built in just 10 days, all in response to this outbreak across the country there. And the Chinese now trying to build another hospital as well. They're hoping that these new hospitals will help slow the spread of the coronavirus there. Well, here as public health officials struggle to contain that deadly virus and save lives, researchers are furiously looking for a cure. Yeah, that's right. They've been at it for now for years, and they may be one step closer. And it's all because of a discovery made by researchers at Butler University here in Indianapolis. In this small, crowded basement laboratory, Dr. Christopher Stobart and his research assistants are targeting the protein that enables the coronavirus to reproduce. I'm trying to throw a wrench into the works that, so we can block and shut down this engine, this protein that the virus uses for its replication. Think of a coronavirus protein as a complicated car engine. You need to find the one part or piece of this engine that it can't run without, then break it. Finding that right part is difficult. The Butler University assistant professor and his students have been looking for three years. The proteins also have a lot of moving parts in a lot of uh, regions and, and, and parts that we don't know what they do. What part? But they are getting closer. The team recently identified a previously undiscovered piece of that critical protein. The discovery and the work students say is exciting. The idea of your research actually being pertinent to the everyday life of people around you. I never anticipated um, that the same type of virus that I'm working on will one day be on the news. If the coronavirus's weak spot is identified, then someone has to find a drug or a chemical that's going to block that protein, and then we have to show that drug is safe to give to people. Meaning a possible cure for the coronavirus is likely years away. Rich Van Wyk, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. And the doctor told Rich that he does expect the findings will be published within the next six months.